Brittany, as always, thank you. Well, a prominent Utah artist and film industry leader made an appearance today in court. And for the second time in a week, Sterling Van Wagenen admitted to sexually abusing a child. The 71-year-old, known for his work as a filmmaker, Sundance Film Festival co-founder and producer of media works for The Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, as well as Brigham Young University and the University of Utah, spoke one word in response to the charge. We have discussed what the preliminary hearing is, what it means, and what a waiver means. I believe he understands that and is ready to move forward um, today, waiving and then entering the plea as described. Waiving his right to preliminary hearing, Van Wagenen stood in court again today to answer yet another criminal charge of aggravated assault against a child and to enter his plea. Have you pleaded that on January 1st, 2013, in Salt Lake County, you committed an aggravated sexual abuse against a child? With one word, the once prominent filmmaker and co-founder of the Sundance Film Festival admitted to a second child sex abuse offense. Prosecutors say both offenses victimized the same girl who was between seven and nine years of age when she was abused in 2013. Now a teenager, the girl was reportedly prompted to speak out when she heard a recording of a phone call in which Van Wagenen admitted to molesting this man in 1993. Sean S. Escobar told ABC4's Andrew Reeser he recorded the conversation in hopes of warning others and finding more victims. I still can't get out of my mind, are there other victims? And that's where my focus is and that's, that's really where my intention is. I, I don't really care about what they sentence him to. Well, six years to life is the probable sentence. Escobar now lives in St. George. He says he hopes the exposure prompts other victims, if any, to also come forward. His recorded conversation first went public on the website truthandtransparency.org. It's the website of the Truth and Transparency Foundation. Go to abc4.com for a link to that website where you can listen to the Van Wagenen recording.